And your character spent years without her husband, raising the family. How do you think Percy's adventures inspired Nina's conduct back home? I think she was really frustrated. I think being a woman then was really hard. And, um, but she was integral to his, um, to his journey. She found a document which proved that there was this city. She was behind the scenes raising the children, but she was strong and brave and courageous. And she's a really good woman. Did you see like elements of like the suffragette movement sort of resonating in her character at all? Yeah, because she was a suffragette. Yeah. So she was out there campaigning for women's rights. And I wanted her to be honored because of that. And I feel like we've got a long way to go as women, but people like that really started the conversation and should be um, honored for it. So Percy Fawcett had the most adventurous spirit. How adventurous are you? I think I'm pretty adventurous. Yeah, I think I am. I've done, I've had adventures. I went to the, to the Congo for three weeks. Wow. Into the Congolese jungle, which was really intense on like a humanitarian trip and there were children with AK-47s. It was, I had to interview my, my rebels and, and in a slightly adrenaline junkie way, really liked how yeah. afraid I was. And I lived in Guatemala when I was 18 in a meditation center and traveled around Central America. But nowadays, I don't really like spiders. <laughs> and so the idea of being in this jungle, having heard some of the stories, I mean, Charlie Hunnam got a fly in his ear that ate his eardrum and yeah. he could hear the flapping and, that would have sent me around the bend. And what's your own favorite or dream destination to visit? Um, oh, it depends. Like Italy in the summer is amazing because of the pasta. <laughs> and <laughs> I've always wanted to go to Easter Island because it just looks just amazing with those big sculpture heads and it's really hard to get to and remote. You know, Bora Bora would be nice, mm -hmm. haven't been there. Um, and then Mexico, I love the food again. <laughs> Street food and food, more food.